Hey guys, today we're making up these mini meatloaf muffins. They're freezable and great for lunch or dinner or a snack. So let's make them up. So the first thing you want to do is add about a pound or half a kilo of lean ground beef. And I use lean because you don't want all that oil or grease to a mixing bowl. Followed by three cloves of really finely chopped garlic. And half a small chopped onion. Again, really finely chopped because you don't want clumps in the meatloaf. About a quarter cup of breadcrumbs. I'm using Italian here. And this gives us that extra little bit of body. An egg for that binding agent. About a tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. I just love this stuff. A couple of tablespoons of ketchup. Now I've used uh, barbecue sauce too, which works extremely well. Some Italian seasoning. Uh, I'd say about a teaspoon. And I use this for everything, but it's completely optional. A few cracks of salt, not too salty. And some ground black pepper. I'd say about a teaspoon. Again, one of my all-time favorite seasonings. We'll just grab up our wooden spoon and go ahead and mix everything together. That's beginning to look and smell like meatloaf already. And it's interesting to note, guys, that you can take the most basic, basic ingredients and uh, just add the right seasoning, you know, and the right spices and make it incredibly delicious. No wonder seasoning and spices were used as an international trade or an international currency way back when. Okay, now our meatloaf is all mixed up. I'm going to make up my all-time favorite secret sauce by adding about three tablespoons of ketchup to a measuring cup. Followed by, yes, you guessed it, a tablespoon of Worcester sauce, a dash of garlic, I'd say about oh, half a teaspoon, just according to your taste. Of course, a little crack of salt and a crack of ground black pepper. And simply... Go ahead and mix this up. Now I'm just going to grab up my muffin tray and give these a little bit of a spray. There should be enough grease in the, uh, in the ground beef, but just as a precaution. Take my handy dandy ice cream scoop and scoop up a good ball of it. Then simply put it into the muffin tray and just kind of smooth it out a little bit. Kind of funny, uh, when I was going to university, and we're talking about frozen food here, my family used to make up these little kits for me that I would put in the, uh, the fridge or the freezer in my dorm. And they just came in so handy, it was so great, just come home after, after university and uh, have my dinner, slip them out, slip them into a microwave or oven, just worked out perfect. I just love the concept of these, you know, make and freeze meals. Now we're gonna take up some of that wonderful sauce and just kind of pour it over the meatloaf muffins. Oh, this is gonna be so wonderful. Then just kind of smooth these guys out with a brush. Make sure they're all nicely covered. Now these guys are going into 375 degree Fahrenheit, 190 Celsius preheated oven for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, out of the oven we come, guys, and just look at this. Wow. And what we're going to do here is let them cool down a bit, I'd say for about 15 minutes. Okay, now they're cooled a little bit. I'm just going to grab one up here. And just look at this, guys. Aren't they cute? And we'll just slip this on our plate. And just look at Wow. I can't. I just love it. And the rest of these guys are going to go into our sealable container. And we're going to freeze these. And of course, guys, what you want to do is let them cool completely before you put the covers on. And these containers you can pick up just about anywhere. Amazon, I'll put a link below for Amazon, but you can get them at the dollar store too. And I've had these for lunch. And what you do is you pull them out of the freezer, let them thaw for about 20 minutes, and then, then into the microwave. And like I say, have them for lunch, for dinner, whatever you like. Just absolutely spectacular. And there you have it, guys. Our freezable muffin tray meatloaf. Oh, wow. You're going to love them. Of course, let's dig into these guys and see what we have. Oh, oh. Just look at this. Meatloaf at its best. 
Mm. Spectacular. That coating, that sauce is so good. Very vibrant, just about rich. Mm. The ground beef is tender, it's juicy. Mm. Imagine this for lunch next day. Mm. Simply slip it in the microwave. Oh, I could go on, but it is so good. You gotta make this, guys. More, of course. Mm.